I was a Sergeant in the Marine Corps. I served with the 1st Battalion, 7th Marines, Scout Sniper Platoon in Iraq, 2004-2005. Redeployed was a great book. This book really speaks to veterans because it deals with the issues that everybody deals with when they're getting out. And it comes from two authors that have been through this war. I mean, they've been down through the hard times in the darkness and they've risen up above everything that they've been through. And it, and it really gets down on a personal level. You need to pick this book up and give it a shot. I mean, you've got nothing to lose and it's, it's really gonna make a big difference in your life, believe it or not. As a mother of a son that's in the military, I, um, when I got this book, I poured into it and I read it within two hours. It really grabbed me because it gave me a lot of insight as to what the guys are going through, and girls I should say, when they're over there. I mean, you need to take the time to read through this because this is going to give you a, a much better understanding of what your husband, your son, your, your uh, father, whoever it may be, of what they're walking through when you have those times with them that you don't understand when they act out. Well, this is so important and will give you so many tools to be able to understand and deal with what you're going through and know that you're not alone out there. One of the most important things that Redeployed has already accomplished is very high reviews by people who are struggling with post-traumatic stress. And in the book, there are literal steps toward healing. It's not only a number one bestseller, but it's a number one bestseller in the hearts of those who read it. And here's what's nice. It's not one generation. It moves to the next generation, the next generation. A book is forever. And what's learned out of this can be transferred. In writing this book based on our own personal combat experiences, we also talked with and mentored hundreds of other combat veterans who had unpleasant and even extreme war experiences and some even worse experiences after coming home. Yet each of these individuals were able to move beyond their situations and productively move forward in life after war. With 22 veterans a day committing suicide, now is the time to get this information out before it's too late. I, l I look at my situation as a, now I look back at it as, as a, a tremendous blessing because I get to look back at my experiences and say, man, I learned so much from going through this struggle that I went through. And um, I, I'm on the other side of it now looking back and even though it was just this dark period and total like just a uh, terrible period in our life, me and, my, me and my wife, my family's life, I look back at it and it would never change a thing. Giving insight to military families and showing combat veterans how to win the war at home. That's what Redeploy is all about. Simplify. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>